baby dance. The baby dance? Yeah, it was like... Okay. I don't know. The baby baby. Uh, Lovely. Alright, number 27. Off the deep end? Off the rectum damn near... Killed him? Oh, don't say that. <laughs> it's a freaking Tommy Boy quote, or Black Sheep, or whatever <laughs> that movie was. It's a good movie. It's a good movie. Love the movie. Great movie. All right. Uh, so, uh, we, we, were, we were out having dinner. It was your birthday dinner, and we passed this place called South Down Market Place? South Down or South? Yeah. South Down. It was in West Islip, actually out by a couple of friends of ours, Kim and uh, Paul, and she said she'd been there quite a few times and she likes it, so. Hey guys, hey. All right, uh, so the store is actually, it's small, but it's really nice, and they have like, all the food looked really good, right? We got this funky uh, cheddar cheese, like spread kind of, with pistachio. We couldn't really. T it was green. Yeah. And the like, the cheddar, and the pistachio kind of like cancelled each other out. I don't know. I thought it was good, but you really were looking forward to pistachio. Mm. Pistachio, huh? All right. So, well, actually, we got a lot of like, found a lot of things like in the refrigerated section. So, what do we should go uh, for? Salt. See. Savory. Yeah. Okay. I think so. Should we go with the pop popcorn? We found this new popcorn. It's called Pop Art Popcorn. Hawaiian Sea Salt. Their website is really cool. Check out the link. Well, Hawaiian Sea Salt with avocado oil. It's a certified GF. Great. Great farts. Um, uh, excuse me, it's made with uh, avocado oil, whole grain, uh, kosher, gluten-free, vegan-friendly, air-popped, and uh, only 48 calories, 45 calories per cup. Of course, I can't see, because if you could just find something that would help my eyes, I'd be great. Uh, 140 calories per serving, 45 calories per cup, 7 grams of fat, 1 saturated, no trans, uh, 180 milligrams of sodium, 17 grams of carbohydrates, that's pretty high for Well, that's like three minute. cups. Oh, uh, is it? A serving size is three cups. Oh, yeah. I'm just looking at the per cup and thinking. Not thinking, obviously. Uh, three grams of protein. The ingredients are only popcorn, avocado oil, and natural Pacific sea salt. Specific. Pacific. Made in the USA. Let's, let's pop it open. Smells like cardboard. Popcorn. Does it? it tastes like popcorn. It's a little stale. Think so? Yeah. I don't think so. Yeah. Maybe it's the avocado oil? If not, it's like crisp as um. Less or evil. evil. It almost tastes a little bit like rice cake. I don't know. I like it. It's clean. It doesn't taste like rice cake. Uh, the website is really cool. It's a lot of like. Obviously, the bag is crazy. And 
that had like all kinds of flavors and stuff, right? Um, well, not the store. No, no not the store, store, but like sweet and salty, sparkles. Uh, shit, go back. Where are we? Ah, no. Rosemary truffle, pepper parmesan, dill, dill pickle, pickle, vegan, vegan ranch. ranch. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. Oh no, they had the Christmas one there. Oh yeah, maple kettle. Uh, that one. Sweet and salty holiday sparkles, kettle corn, pepper parmesan, pop stars, well, that's barbecue. Not popcorn. Those are like white, white cheddar. Oh, those look like little like um, almost like uh, checks. yeah, checks. Cheddar jalapeno. I think I said that already. Pepper parmesan. I think I said too. All right. right. Anyway, moving on. Okay. Next. These are chipmunk, chipmunk, toasted coconut keto bites. Chipmunk. All the taste, none of the sugar. And let's see. Funny thing is, when I looked it up, I got pictures of chipmunks. Wow. When I looked up pop art, I got a lot of pop art crap. Not crap, but like just a ton of stuff. I had to actually put popcorn in. Anyway, go ahead. Proceed. Uh, the ingredients are almond flour, allulose, butter, coconut, coconut milk, eggs, vanilla extract, natural coconut flavor. I'm talking salt. Cone jack powder, Salem husk powder, baking soda. Soda? Sodium bicarbonate, plant fibers, lemon pea, potato, plantain, Norwegian kelp, vitamin E, natural mix, taco ferrules, and mug fruit extract. Mm. Um, one bite is 90 calories. One bite? Yeah. So if I take one well, bite of it? it's keto, so it's higher in fat. Seven grams of fat. Three grams saturated fat, four hundred. I mean, forty-five milligrams sodium, eight grams of carbs, two fiber, zero sugars, and two protein. And the co-founders, Jose, who's a diabetic baker with a sweet tooth. Mm. This is how. There's like a video of him on the site when you first hit the site. All the sites look really cool. Yeah. Of all the products that we got, pretty neat sites. So definitely check them out if you get a chance. Whoa. Like cakey. Mmm, smells good too. Coconut. Oh wow. It's almost like a macaroon. Mmm. That's freaking good. Very dense. Like, like me? Mm-hmm. Damn, those things are good. I could eat that whole bag. Dangerous. Very, very buttery. Good, like, coconut taste. And, like, yeah, cakey. What's that? Not bad at all. Alright, moving on. Go back to savory. Oh, yeah, I thought that was savory too until until you put it in your mouth. Yeah. All right, this one is uh, everybody eat their uh, baked, not fried, fiery chili lime thins. They're almost like um. I could cheese it. Ah, uh, I would like think pita. more like a like a cracker. Tostito. Yeah. No. A no, I like chip. a cracker. Okay. I guess this is the ingredients, right? On the front: potato starch, brown rice flour, extra virgin olive oil, lime juice, pumpkin seeds, nutritional yeast, ancho chilies, sea salt, onion, cayenne, white pepper, red chili pepper. Ah, uh, nutritional. Oh yes, yeah, sorry. Jumping the gun. Uh, 140 calories per serving. 16 crackers as a serving. Uh, five grams of fat. Very good. 190 milligrams of sodium. 
20 grams of carbs, one fiber, no sugars, three proteins. Uh, yeah, I read these already. Flavor you can trust. Everybody eat isn't just another snack. It's a declaration to create a world where everybody feels included. Food, dude. Dude! Do the old smell test. It really doesn't smell like anything. I smell spice. Smell, eh, maybe a little bit. Maybe it is a little like a toastito. Oh, what? Like the ones you get like at a nacho a chip? Restaurant. Yeah. Mm. Pretty good. They're not like super like chippy crunchy. They're spicy. They're a little more like. They're very thin. Yeah, they don't have that consistency of a chip. They're soft. Mm-hmm. And man, the spice hits you like yeah. a few seconds later. It's pretty good though. Yeah, they're hot. Hot. <laughs> I don't get too much of the lime. I think it gets drowned it out by the chili. Fiery. Fire. Fireball. All right. These were all found in the refrigerator section. Refrigeratored section? Yeah, refrigerator. Oh, and the chipmunk keto bites have to be refrigerated after opening. Oh, they do? Yeah. Okay, this is... Oh, man. Glow nuts. <laughs> Glow nuts. Are yummy donut things. Glow nuts. Mm. Classic powdered. Keep refrigerated or it will melt. Um, let's see. Glow nuts. They glow. Kristen and Grover. They made donuts to give you the feeling of eating a donut without feeling you get after eating a donut. Really? Um. Let's see. All right. Ingredients are to, almond to flour, sell. organic coconut, organic unrefined coconut oil, organic coconut butter, organic cocoa butter, ethanol, all right, artificial sweetener, monk fruit, filtered water, organic vanilla extract, organic cinnamon, Himalayan pink salt. All ingredients are non-GMO. No gum, zero seed oils, vegan, gluten-free. Um, I like how they specifically like make it a point to say that. Two servings per container, so there's two donuts. One donut is 130 calories, 12 grams of fat, 7 grams saturated fat, 5 grams of carbs, 2 grams fiber, 2 grams sugar, alcohol, and 2 grams of protein. Wait, how many calories per? 130. For to both of them? No, for, for each. Oh, damn. So maybe we'll split one. Are they shaped like little donuts? Oh, look at the little donut! It looks like a little powdered donut. Entenmann's. Ooh. Oh, powder everywhere. I get the bigger piece, of course. It's Damn! A, a raw donut. Raw dog glow nut. Damn, that's good. It's it like super refreshing. cold too. <laughs> oh, because it was in the refrigerator. Mm. That's delicious. I could eat like four packs of those. I know. Save this here. Very good. I'm gonna have to put it back in the. Just keep it there for now. Refrigerator. It's, it's gonna, gonna melt. <laughs> All right. Next up, Dalsy almond butter chocolate chip blondie. Looks delicious. Feels soft and mushy. Spongy. Spongy. 
Oh, let's see. It's gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free, no refined sugars, store chilled or frozen. Uh, crud. Ingredients are coconut sugar, almond butter, almond flour, eggs, avocado oil, unsweetened chocolate, salt, contains egg and almond. Made in a dedicated gluten-free facility that processes tree nuts and say, eh, whatever. Uh, Woman-owned, minority-owned, and made in the U.S. Hell yeah. Uh, serving size is one bar. Calories per serving is 220. 16 grams of fat. 30 milligrams of cholesterol. 70 milligrams of sodium. 17 grams of carb. 3 grams of fiber. Total sugars is 10. Uh, protein is 6 grams. That's pretty good. What do they have to say in their package? They'll say is on a mission to give classic treats the super clean makeover you deserve. It's real nourishing food to fulfill your <coughs> everyday cravings. Yay! Rich little endorphin boosters. Alright. Good. It's good. It's, uh, again, very cakey, like the donut. Almost like pumpkin bread. It's got, like, nice, yeah, exactly. I couldn't really put my finger on it. But that's just the texture. Yeah. Good. Nice job. Excellent. West. One more. But not Peanut least. butter chocolate chip ready to eat. Bite sized protein cookie dough. Buy Eat Pastry. Eat Pastry. Oh, Their man. website is really cool. It's like this funky map of things going on all over the place. And I think they, it's make, really neat. they make edible cookie dough like in a jar, too. I think, I think they I make edible that. marijuana. Oh. I'm just kidding. Um, vegan, dairy-free, egg-free, soy-free. The whole package is, is a whole package is 170 calories. It feels like there's like a couple balls in here. Eight grams of Are they fat. Nuts? <laughs> Eight grams of fat. Five grams saturated fat. Uh, 23 grams of carbs. Four grams of fiber. 11 grams of sugar. Five grams of protein. And the ingredients are wheat flour, applesauce, organic coconut sugar, semi-sweet chocolate, nice. coconut oil, pea protein, peanut butter, oat fiber, pure vanilla extract. Mm. Good ingredients. Uh, package is so small. Small balls? It just smells like dough. I can't really get my schnoozer in well, there. Well, you're not supposed to stick your nose inside of it. Well, I gotta smell it. Oh, it's like a... It's like a roll up. Look at that little guy. Like a plunked out piece of cookie dough. It doesn't have that, like... Very peanut buttery. Yeah. Uh, it's much smoother. It's not like cookie dough consistency. Yeah. I like it. I like these nuts. I'm sorry, the dough uh, capsules, nuts? you want to call them? <laughs> I just, the glow nuts <laughs> cracked me up. 
And they don't have, have got glow nuts on the brain. These are good choices. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Nice job. They have though. more too. But, oh, they have they like did have a more. lot in the refrigerated section. Yeah, but they didn't have much in the dry section. Anyway, that's uh, that's a wrap, ah, I guess. Cut me off. Oh, I'm sorry. What it's cutting me off. Oh, it's cutting you off. Why is it doing that? Did you move your hand? No. I think you did. Mm -hmm. Oh, it tracks. Why is it tracking automatically? Damn it. Anyway, um, yeah. Oh, yeah, I wanted to say that uh, I'm going to include a link uh, about industrial seed oils, which seem to be in every damn thing. It's hard to find that's something that doesn't have it. You didn't get any this time. So, you know, the site that I'm going to post, is it's probably a little bit biased, but at the same time, it's kind of, it's a little unnerving, and, the, you know, the process that goes into making those things edible, and the fact that they're just in the food in the first place, is just, I don't know, I don't like it. It's, apparently it causes inflammation, and potentially other long-term things. Uh, I'm not a scientist, obviously, and I don't claim to be one, but, you know, just do your research, man. Look it up. Well, they're saying even if it says high olecic, oh, say that? Olesic? Olesic. Yeah, Sunflower high olesic. I don't even think that really... Lot, it doesn't matter. It's still yeah. just as bad. But the process to, to make it is just, it's chemicals and oh, superheating and just... It's, uh, yeah, you'll see. Just uh, take a look at it if you want to. All right. Well, you guys have a good week. Have a great week. And uh, we'll see you maybe next week. We have to try and find some more stores. I wish we could travel a little more. Um, there's not a whole lot in Nassau County. We could go to, like, some different states maybe here and there. But it's, it's tough. We work. We both work six days a week. So, uh, it's difficult. So we'll just keep poking around at our local stores and, you know, all these foods that we find have websites you can order stuff. Um, might be a little bit pricier, but it's, you know, what's, what's, the what's your damn health worth, you know? All right. I've said my piece. I'll shut my hole now. Have a great week. Bye for now. Bye.